What's up guys, welcome back, it's Jesse Gilly here, back with another video, and today we are doing our biggest unboxing we have done on this channel yet. I really like that light, sorry guys, it's just... So guys, we cannot forget we have our special knife that has been in all our videos, it's like a mascot almost, and we've got our rubber dooby duck bear guy, McGooby bear, I don't know if you guys remember this guy, but he's always with us in our unboxings, um, that's, that's McGooby bear, um, we've got these two, so now we can start the video and, yeah. Ooh, my hair's so messy, man, whoo, maybe I can, yeah, I'll probably just leave that on. Okay, let's get into the video. This is the box. It is, uh, let, let's just get a close up on that. If you can see that, guys, it is, um, 200, 200, 2.60 kilograms worth of playing cards. Can you guys guess how many right now? I'll give you 10 seconds. One, two, okay. 10 seconds, tell me down below. How many cards you think are in here? How many playing cards you think are in here? Tell me down below. I'll give you 20 seconds. Um, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five. Just, just pause the video and comment down below how many cards you think is in here. This is our biggest playing card unboxing we've done yet. 2.60 kilograms worth of playing cards. It's heavy, guys. It's heavy. Okay. <clears throat> You've done it. There is 21 decks of playing cards in here. That's... That's almost two bricks. That's a lot of cards. So, uh, let's get into it. I think we just got into it, but, all right, whatever. You have no idea how hard it was not to open this when it came. Woo! Oh, yeah, we got some, uh, bubble wrap, guys. Oh, it smells like... Oh, by the way, you're probably wondering who the sender of this is. Quick story, so um, this was sent to by someone for uh, a video I have to make uh, on these cards. I'm not going to tell you who the sender was. Um, if you've been following me on Instagram for a while and stuff, you probably already know who the sender is. But I basically had to get these cards sent to me as soon as possible, so um, they're in bulk sales. So the company who sent me this don't actually pack boxes like this normally. This is just sent to me because it had to be sent to me quickly. So it was sort of a rush and bulk together. So this is not how he packs his stuff normally. Just putting that out there now. I'm not saying telling you who it is. Also guys, if you're watching this still right now, we have a giveaway on, I think it's uh, the 3rd of November. If I haven't uploaded this video by the 3rd of November, go over to my Instagram. I've left a link down below. We're doing a collaboration with by Worthy, and basically we're giving away Chris Ramsey's new first puzzle. That's, I think it's worth like 60 Australian, that's like uh, 50 US or something. Go check out that, I'm giving that away, um, the rules are very simple, you just gotta follow us both on Instagram, and that's that's literally it. So go, go check that out, link down below. Um, let's get back into this unboxing, shall we? We almost crushed the remote then. How's it going? Sorry guys, I haven't had breakfast yet and it's like 10 in the morning here, so I'm a little bit low in energy, so I'll probably be overdosing energy soon with, um, I was going to say coffee, I don't really drink coffee. Um, anyway, another bubble wrap. At this point, I just think I just literally ordered just bubble wrap. Woo. Woo. There's the first brick, guys. Excited as heck right now. Um, I don't think I've ever ordered this many playing cards before. Um, and then there's the other one, we'll open that later. Um, and I, I literally think I just ordered bubble wrap at this point, but um, that's awesome. Bubble wrap is really good because I order, um, I send off the giveaways, a lot of playing cards, so you got to know that your cards will arrive safely, whatever I give away next. Now guys, if you're new here, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. You know the drill. Wait, if you're new here, then how would you know the drill? Okay, never mind. Um, whoa, first brick here we have, well, whoa, shivers in the timbers. That opened quickly. Let's uh, show us what we've got. We've got the, sorry, we've got 
got these cards by Emily Slight 52. If you don't know who she is, she's an amazing card designer. I think she's designed like 10 decks of cards. She puts them on Kickstarter. This is her one that she currently released. She's actually got one on Kickstarter right now. So those are those. Um, <coughs> and then we've got the Moon Playing Cards. Oh, these look cool. I don't know if you can see that, but they look really, really cool. M the moon playing cards. It's actually full. We actually got two full moons this um, month. I think we already had one. And then there's a full moon on Halloween. Uh, Halloween. It's Australia here, so we don't really celebrate it. Well, I don't celebrate it. Um, over, over there, I think it's... By the time I'm recording this video, it's Halloween today. But I think in America, the real Halloween, I think Australia just copied is um, tomorrow, so you haven't missed out yet. We got the social playing cards by, I think it's Harry, I don't know what his name is, but I think he designed this deck, super popular guy, he's got a site on Instagram, he sells like playing cards called social playing cards, very popular guy. He is a loved guy in the card community. That's deck number three. We've got the uh, gold standards deck, it's actually not the gold one, but it's the red one. Um, it just says gold on it. Um, that's that, and then we've got, whoo, Paley Beeb. Oh yeah, yeah, these are by Vanishing Ink, aren't they? Yeah, I think this is one of the Vanishing Ink decks. They've designed heaps of them out there. Um, oh man, I love this. It's like, I'm not gonna tell you who it is, but when you order from them, they have like, whoo, it's like perfume they put on the cards. I'm not sure what it is. It smells really good though. Then we've got the Wild West Black Hills playing cards. These look really weird but cool. Um, got the oh, shivers and timbers. Don't want to damage them. And then we've got the uh, the piano playing cards. If you're a pianist, if you like music, these would be your cards that you'd buy. I don't know if you can hear that, but uh, my neighbor's driving past at like 400 kilometers per hour, and it's really loud. Yeah, he's gone. And we've got the, um, we've got these decks. <laughs> I don't know what this is actually. It doesn't really have a name. Um, we've got that, that guy, this guy, old mate. Um, then we've got the pop camo. Uh, yeah, pop camo, pop camo, yeah. I like the back design. I'm not a huge fan of the face cards, um, but yeah. It's alright. And oh my gosh, we've got an Emily Slight stick. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I didn't know that was gonna come in here, so that's that's super cool. Awesome guys. Thank you. Um and King Slayer. Guys, if if you know if you know what um if you know uh Illusionist, so actually the recording of this video, Illusionist has just shut down. Their site is gone, their Instagram is gone. I don't know if you know, but Illusionist they're, they've disappeared. Um, Brad Christian sent an email to Iran and stuff. Um, he's, he's saying that he's going to explain what happened in the next three days, but Illusionist is gone, guys. Illusionist was the first place I ever bought playing cards off. I bought Blue Keepers. There's a video on that, actually. I've left a link down below. Or you can search it somewhere. Blue Keepers. I made a video on that. Anyway, but there is so many of these. There's like a yellow, a green, a, a purple. There's like a rainbow, there's a, there's a turd color. There's probably even a David Blaine color. Like, I don't know what the color of his skin is, but there is so many colors of this deck. It's not funny. I don't know why they created so many. Um, then we've got uh, Discover New Horizon playing cards. These are the spacey cards. They look very cool. I like the face cards. They're very spacey. Space. <laughs> then we've got another Emily Slight 52 girl Play your last hand well. I saw this deck and I always wanted it, so I'm so glad that this came. Actually, I chose the deck, so it doesn't matter. Sorry, I just had to re recut that. I don't know if you've ever edited a little bit. I don't know if you've ever edited a video before, but if you just have one continuous video, it will take forever to edit. So you gotta sort of halfway between just sort of cut, cut, cut. Otherwise, it will just be a long video and it will be a nightmare to edit. Um, whew. I'm actually currently working on a video right now. Um, it's basically a uh, 
I'm not going to tell you the title of it, but I'm working on a very cool video, so make sure you turn that bell on so you're posted when it is posted. Um, and there might be a talk of collaboration with Car Perfect Magician on this project, so uh, stay tuned for that. And woo! Bit of a toffee. Okay, now if you know what, it smells like cigarettes. Oh no, that smells like candy, that's my nose. I haven't had breakfast yet, so remember I'm a little bit high, uh, low in energy. Um, if you know where that sticker is from, then you know who sent these cards. Um, yeah, that probably gave it away a bit. You ever do that when you see like a deck of cards and you're like, I've always wanted them, but just like over the years you've been staring at them for so long, then like two years later you finally get that deck of cards. I don't know if you've ever done that before, but that happens to me like all the time. Um, quick story here, I watched um, Chris Ramsey do a video on, hang on, let's not try and reveal them all at once. He did a video um, with the red one of, and the blue one of this, these guys, the um, uh, playing cards, I think they're the wheel, wheel playing cards. Anyway, he did a video on these and I saw them and they're like his favorite cards at the time. Always use them in all of his videos and I just won them on day one and I finally got my hands on them and that still looks really cool actually. Yeah, that's a really cool deck of cards. Um, they're a bit dented but heck. I don't care, they look cool. Um, moving on, we have, uh, ooh. Nice, I don't know what those are. I think those are the gold foil glided playing cards. Yes, yes, those are cool. Um, then we have, the, oh, these are new by Ripple Shuffle, they just came out, the V3s, keen to look into those. Um, yeah, this is a print run of one, uh, 5,000, one of 5,000, awesome. By the way, when there is a print run done, it is not always exact, so it's either under or over, so there's not exactly 5,000 of these ever printed. Just putting that out there. Um, uh, flux, not, not sure that deck of cards, I think it's like a monster eyes on the back sign. Yeah, 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 that's it. Um, and then we have, we have the uh, seventh edition Orbit here. Woo! Cool deck of cards, hey? Um, and, oh my gosh, this is the one I'm most excited for. It's, um, yeah, it's it's basically a, a meant to look like, a, it's by King Wild Project, and it's meant to look like a um, postage, and it's actually a real stamp on there, so, They've done a really awesome job of that deck of cards. Um, I'm so hyped to actually check them out and review it. Um, whew. Oh, that's the uh, V4s of the, um, the well, Spen Spengali deck uh, by Alex Pandrea. Actually, fun fact, he always makes them uh, one-way designs, and I don't think this deck is a one-way design. Yeah, I don't think it's a one-way design. That's, I think it's the first deck he hasn't made a one-way design. Um, then we've got this deck here, which is just like a guard 2017. It's like the, the um, I don't know what it is, but it looks cool. Cool. The last one we have, drum roll please. And again, this is another deck I've always wanted one of. The Theory 11 Tycoon deck. That is... All the decks I got, I'm not going to say that's it because that was a lot of cards. So here's a quickie close up in case you missed the decks up close. Apologize if it's a bit shaky, I'm just holding my tripod right now. So we have here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 decks of playing cards. Bam, baby. Woo! Woo! Actually, that would be a really cool shot. Grab, grab the orbits and just be like this. 
Yeah, maybe not, maybe not. Um, but yeah, guys, that's uh, that's the uh, that's the uh, depths there. I'm pretty much just filming everything right now. But Goofy Bear just said, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below. It's very important because it does help this video. I share this to a friend if you really did enjoy it. And and I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Hold on, let's do like a pose here. And I hope you guys enjoyed that video because it just got real. Outro. Pickaboo, pickaboo, pickaboo. Yeah, I'm gonna go have breakfast now, guys. I hope you did enjoy that video. I don't know what just happened then. Um, yeah. Enjoy this video, like, subscribe, um, I'll see you guys in the next one, and we're going to get a new backdrop, so stay tuned for that, I might do an unboxing, don't know if you guys will enjoy that or not, also I'm saving for a uh, drone and a GoPro, so we can do underwater stuff, I don't know if playing cards are even water.